Okay. So you got all excited, you built your Voron, and then you're like, oh, I see this mod. It's a pin mod. I'm going to do that. It says it's going to be better and all this jazz, right? So you go ahead and you print these parts off, all right? You get your, you buy the pins because you ain't going to cut that metal yourself, right? So you buy the pins, you install it all in, and now your axes look a little, look off. And you've done everything, right? You've tensioned the belts. You're like, oh, I got that. You make sure this thing's moving smooth, right? Everything's kind of tight, looks good. It's still off. Well, why is that? One of the reasons is the pins themselves. And it's not the pin per se, it's how we printed the parts and then we squished it together. So me, for example, this thing right here, these my holes are too small for the pins. So when I had to put them on, I had to really squeeze down, right? I had to put everything in, all the, the, the eyelers, the bearings, right? Put them in and then kind of like, ugh, I, it must have been on, on, on the table, right? So I'm sitting here, I'm grinding it in, oh, get in. And it got in, right? And then I put it together and I try input shaper again and there's problems. Why? I do, I do everything, right? I'm, I'm tightening bolts, I'm loosening bolts, doing everything. I'm still getting some problems. It's this right here, and it's this right here. So when these pins, this hole is too small for your pins, yeah, it'll go, but what happens is when you push down, the plastic holds onto it. It doesn't release a bit, and then you got these bolts behind it. Well, you loosen these bolts. You're like, I'm gonna loosen these bolts. Yeah, that's fine, but the plastic in the pin is still too hard, so it's still clamping on it. So how do you fix this? Well, you loosen these bolts, you loosen these bolts here, these screws and these things here, right? And then you get something in, in it's not going to look pretty, not going to look pretty. You get something in here to lift this up, right? And lift this, let me get you a better view, lift that up right there. You got to kind of try to separate them because right, what's happening is it looks like everything's running smooth, right? Everything's going smooth. But you got this little thing here is binding onto the to the, your pulley because there's no washer there. There's a little bit of plastic, I think, on the bottom, and that's about it. The 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 bearing stack here has the has the washers on top and bottom, but this doesn't. So we've already found in my previous video that if you screw have the regular screw and you screw down too tight, it doesn't move, right? The same thing's happening here. It's just it's the it's the pla the size of the hole to the diameter of the of the pin you got to separate you got to relieve a little bit of that tension so you unscrew it you find a way it's not going to look pretty to separate them and then you can kind of gently put it back in and tighten everything back up if you're if you're just confounded you got if you have the pin mod you're confounded you can't figure out what the hell is going on i would look to this you know it's just it's just another step in the troubleshooting i'm not going to say it's going to fix it but it's been my problem in the past.